Hi, Dr. P here to talk about conflict in games. Now, the traditional definition of a game is that there must be a conflict. History is full of conflict, although there's also cooperation and indifference. But when you have a competition, conflict tends to happen. Now, if you look up definitions of novels, you'll find the same thing, that generally they say there needs to be a conflict, whether it's between the protagonist and the forces of nature or whether there's an actual antagonist, there's still a conflict. On the other hand, we have Euro-style game designers who usually do as much as they can to remove conflict from the game. In other words, they're making it into parallel competition. Well, we do have games that are parallel competitions, but they're usually sports related and not tabletop related. For example, a swimming contest in the Olympics. Everybody has their own separate lane. There's not anything that the players, the, the swimmers, can do to affect the outcome, although they can still try to use psych tactics outside of the actual competition itself, just as is true of any game. You can try to psych the opponent out. Now, my ideal in games is a cooperative game with human opposition. That is to say, a role-playing game. Because then you have the advantage of cooperation. You can have high interaction between the players. Unfortunately, low conflict usually means low interaction with player to player. And yet, the opposition is controlled by a human who is much better than any kind of programming, whether it's programming with cards or programming with a computer. Uh, we should also consider in this discussion that many of those Euro games are essentially puzzles, and puzzles have always been more popular than games because you're less likely to feel stupid. Your ego is less on the line. You can't really lose a puzzle. So it's understandable that modern games have got onto this parallel competition thing and away from conflict. Unfortunately, that tends to make for a less interesting and certainly less exciting game, but that's a choice that designers have made, and certainly it's a choice that many, many players have followed. Thanks for listening.